Hi guys and welcome to my October favourites. So the first thing, you're probably sick of seeing these now, these are featured in so many of my YouTube videos. These are my Doc Martens Serena boots and they are just literally, as I've said time and time again, they are the comfiest shoes I've ever owned and they are super cosy with the faux fur lining inside and these are available in different colours and I highly recommend these. I'll link below if you want to hear about these and I also compare them against my original black ones so do check that out if you are interested. My second favourite of last month is Game of Thrones. I have completed series one and two. I completed the first series in a weekend and the second series was just over a weekend. It is so good when I hear a TV show or a film or something like that is meant to be amazing. Kind of having, I don't know, like hearing that it's going to be really good. Usually things don't live up to that for me, but this really did. The first episode I was a bit like, this is okay. Then the ending of that I just had to watch more. When I first started watching it I was like, I will watch one episode and I watched three in one night. They are around an hour long and there are 10 episodes in a series but I highly recommend it is so good it's so addictive so now I need to try and find the third series and watch that really love this um, if there's any other TV series you think I should watch I've heard um, Breaking Bad, Homeland, any others then please let me know because I'm getting quite addicted to TV series the third favourite of last month is pink hair so I'm back to pink again I'm not really sure how pink it looks um, recently in my last video I was back to blonde for a little bit because I did a shoot for a company which was really fun and they preferred me to be blonde and I was getting my roots done anyway so I kind of had my hair toned and I was fading the pink out because there's kind of no point topping up the pink when I was going to get my roots done. I really love having this colour, it's just really subtle and I don't know I think walking around Norwich last year I had pink hair and I did get a lot of strange looks but this year not so many so I think just you know the general public are used to us younger people having different coloured hair. I've worn this black fluffy Topshop jumper so much last month and also this month. It is the cropped black one. It just goes with so much. It's really cosy and it's just great for layering. I wear it as it is, I wear with shirts underneath, I wear it on top of dresses, it's just a really good layering piece and I love the texture of this. And as you can tell, I'm wearing the green version, I got this this month, um, so it'll be in my next haul video. I do find they come up differently, like this, um, the black one, it comes up quite like low necked, I've worn it in a few of my videos, um, but this one comes up higher. My friends do have the black fluffy version and theirs is higher, I don't really know. And this is actually a size bigger than my black one but it comes up smaller so maybe I just got a different style to the usual one. These are just so lovely, they are fairly expensive, I think they're £34 but they're just so cosy and I wear them so much that I think it's value for money. My next favourite is a makeup favourite. It's not often that I change up my makeup but I've been loving this. This is a Clinique blusher and it is in Iced Lotus. Clinique had where if you bought two skincare items then you got like a gift set and this is one of the things that featured in it. This is probably the third blusher I've ever used. Um, I'm wearing it now, I don't really know if there's much difference between this and the one I usually wear. I've worn this since my Dot Martens unboxing video and also I've started contouring so I think that'll be a favourite of next month. Some more makeup favourites, these two lipsticks. This one is Barry M and is in shade 160. I got it and I was like oh this will be a lovely kind of vampy dark colour and actually it's quite pink and not really this colour although I've got it on now on top of MAC Russian Red and it's coming up a lot darker kind of layered on that but by itself it does look very different and this is Topshop in shade Inhibition and I wore this one in my Doc Martens unboxing video it's another dark colour this one comes out a lot truer to what it looks like so now some jewellery favourites this necklace from Black Tide is one of my all time favourite necklaces crystal necklaces have been a favourite literally the whole of this year from the very first haul I did back in January even in that a crystal necklace featured and this is just so beautiful it's like a raw amethyst crystal and then with the chain wrapped around it I've seen so many crystal necklaces and this just looks 
so different to the kind of usual so this really stands out for me i really love the length of this i've worn it in an outfit post in the dissolve me outfit post so i can link that below so you can see like the length of how it looks and also i have done a blog post about black tide and i will link that below for you as well more jewelry items are these two rings which i have not taken off my hands in so long i really like wearing them together on the same finger and these are both sterling silver and they're so so lovely i really like investing in sterling silver rings at the moment just because kind of plated ones they do kind of tarnish and you know you can wash your hands and you can do stuff like that and then you have to worry that your fingers are going to go green although you know you can put clear nail varnish in rings but that's just a bit of a hassle if you watched my last haul video then you'd know that i went to see daughter and that was so amazing and then of course one of their songs had to feature in my favorites my favorite song is landfill by them i think it's one of the older ones and it's so, I don't know, it's so pretty. I had heard of like more of the other songs like on the radio. So it was really nice to kind of hear a song that I hadn't heard but I instantly really liked. Usually kind of songs I most like from an artist are what I've heard a lot on the radio but I'd not heard that one before and I instantly fell in love with it. Usually I have an app as a favourite, but again, like last month, I've not really been using any apps. So if you guys have any apps you would recommend to me, then please do in the comments below. So I thought I'd do something different. I'm going to list some of my favourite YouTubers at the moment in no particular order, but I really love Close Encounters. If you like haul videos, styling videos, then she's the girl to check out. She's just so cool, like I really want to be her friend, like watch her and maybe you'll see what I mean. But her videos are so good, when they pop up in my feed I always get really excited to watch them. Another girl I love watching is Beauty Crush or Sammy. Her videos are just really good and she's just so genuine and comes across really well. And another one when her videos pop up in my feed, I'm just so happy to watch them. I love watching her vlog channel as well, just yeah, whenever she makes videos I always make time to watch them. So I featured two girls, I'm going to feature two guys now. I really love Mike Falzone's videos. I don't even really know how I found him but his videos are just really good. Mini advice? I guess? I don't know. I watched loads of them and then my friend Jacqueline saw in my feed that I watched some of them and then she watched and loved and liked and commented on lots of his videos too. He's a guy that talks about like talking to strangers, stuff that he notices. It just makes you think about things and not worry about stuff like once I had a crappy day and then he did a video about like not letting people's comments like get to you it's just stuff that you kind of need to hear and is really helpful he reminds me so much of Nick Miller he gets that a lot from New Girl he commented it once in a video and another favorite is I can't say his name without putting on a funny voice Pretty <laughs> Or Felix, um, his videos are so good. He is hilarious because I know that he uploads every day. He's the reason why I check my YouTube feed every day because I just love watching him. He's just so lovable. Him and Marzia, his girlfriend, they're just so cute. And he is the most subscribed to person on YouTube, which is amazing. When I first followed him, he was on only 8 million, but now I think he's 13, close to 14 million which is insane but yeah he's so lovable and he's so crazy so check out PewDiePie I don't know how to say his name normally it just yeah yeah check him out so that was the end of my October favorites please let me know what youtubers that you like below so I can check out some more people I do love kind of stumbling across new people and being like I'm gonna subscribe to you and I'm gonna watch loads of your videos because before I go to bed or when I have a free kind of few hours while I'm eating my dinner by myself yeah I just entertain myself by watching YouTube videos I don't actually watch TV anymore apart from box sets so yeah please let me know what kind of people that you love watching please comment like and subscribe and thank you for watching so today I'm going to the X Paris event in London and so Jacqueline's vlogging it too so we've just been selfish <laughs> So they came and met up and they're wearing the same shoes. 